Well, I mean, uh, they've obviously proven that just how well they can defend the middle of the ice, defend in front of their net, their net, and we just didn't do as good of a job of getting there and earning some ice, um, better looks, and, and just kind of wearing them down. And then we just made too many mistakes on our end uh, uh, that obviously allowed the game to get away from us. What is your uh, sense of frustration with the officiating tonight? Obviously, we don't usually see that from each other. Yeah, I don't even think he said a whole lot, but uh, I'll let him uh, explain on that one. But uh, we just didn't like the call, especially in a tight hockey game. We didn't think there was much there, uh, if anything at all. Where are you at physically? We saw you on the bench. It looked like you're in discomfort at times. Oh, that was just an equipment issue. I'm physically, I'm great. Okay. Where, where, where can the team take from this? Obviously, it's been a great run. Hard to put a string together wins in this league. What's, what, do you, what sort of response are you looking for coming up this year? Well, I think, I think that's a great point. I think uh, we've obviously been playing some good hockey, put a really good stretch together, and we want to get right back out of obviously disappointed tonight. So um, regroup here and get excited about our next challenge and, and getting back to uh, the way we've been playing and, and continue to push for more. So um, obviously not a great feeling uh, now, and certainly as we leave the rink tonight, a uh, great chance to regroup and respond. How different a night's team was it tonight than the one you saw a few nights ago? Well, that's the challenge when you play a team uh, um, you know, really closely. Uh, in the schedule like that, especially a team that uh, is currently the, the defending champions, and um, you know you play them well and you do a lot of good things, and, and certainly, uh, you know they probably weren't happy with their game, and, and they were going to look to respond and, and defend really well. Especially, you know they're, they're right up there, one of the best uh, teams in how they defend and, and what they give up in their own zone. So certainly, uh, uh, you know they presented another challenge and, and, and brought their game to a different level there. And, and you know we just made too many mistakes, and, and like I said, just didn't earn. Uh, enough opportunities, enough uh, good ice, uh, good looks to really you know wear them down, um, earn those chances, and ultimately get to, uh, get the puck into that as much as we needed to. Yeah, I, I uh, you know had the puck and, and uh, obviously had my back to the play, and I was just trying to feel the pressure, and you know I was on my backhand, and I uh, had the sense that it just. Uh, Mitchie was up on the wall um, and just wanted to go up up the wall and, and get it to him and their guy kind of held held their held the uh, held his ice. I thought he was kind of retreating back inside and, and um, obviously would like to have it back. Like yeah, but uh, we lost two points today. Yeah, and you know like uh, it's hard lost for us, especially for me. Uh, just tomorrow, new day. Especially for you, like you know, like uh, I think we, special right now, we play better. Yeah, we're a better team. Yeah, uh, it's the first one. Like I don't know, you know, like I'm so so mad if we lost some points like that. What, what, made, what made Vegas difficult tonight? It's nothing diff difficult. It's same same team, you know, same guys is coming, but it's. These guys more want to win today, and uh, you know, like these guys come to the come to the net. Good scream, good tip it, rebounds. That's, it. That's what's different. How can the anger help you? Really, you know, will fire you up your, your next chance. I'm not angry. So I'm just uh, you know, like I'm just wanna get a rest for today. Day is over. You know, like it's, uh, I need to be angry and nice, not in the locker room. Yeah, I thought they did a good job, obviously. Um, thought we had a good start. And then we just kind of got away from our game, I think. Uh, and I mean, they were opportunistic and they took advantage of their chances. Yeah, it's challenging. Um, but I feel good over there. I mean, we we try to work on that stuff in practice, changing partners and, and whatnot. So um, there's, there's obviously room for improvement. Um, so moving forward, uh, you know, we as a D Corps just want to be ready and uh, you know, play better than we did tonight. What is the biggest challenge? Is it just the defensive zone? You have like less ice to work. With? Um, it can be that. I mean, and it, you know, I mean, there's an answer that I don't want to give, but it's like it's just the opposite of what you're used to. Like when you're closing gaps, when you're you know crossing over, um, you know, outside of the offensive zone. Um, but you know, it's, it's not about excuses. I mean, it's actually easier in the offensive zone. There are good things as well. So. Um, it's just trying to get familiar with it. What, what happened on that, that, that partnership goal from tools? On the breakaway? Yeah, yeah I mean, I think um, I don't think we expected him to to keep going. I think I mean most times on on those on our offensive zone faceoffs when we win it, uh, you know the other team goes into a, a D zone structure. They don't leave, um, but you know it's on us. It's on me to be aware of that and 
uh, adjust when that happens. Um, I mean, just frustration, like you said. Um, you know, I, I I couldn't hear what he was saying. I think it was, you know, if I had to guess, it was probably about the Marner penalty. Um, but again, I, I couldn't hear what he was saying. Yeah, we just weren't at our best. Um, we weren't playing smart with the puck. Uh, didn't have enough shots either, and, and kind of crashing that. That's how we kind of capitalized uh, in Vegas, and uh, we didn't do that. Did you see a different Vegas, like a more motivated Vegas team tonight compared to a couple nights ago? Yeah, definitely. They were they were a lot better. They were uh, you know on the hunt on the forecheck, and um, you know we we actually had a decent start and kind of dipped a little bit from there, and they kind of capitalized, and um, we can get our momentum back. Yeah, their D did a good job in front of the net and, um, you know, boxing out and um, we didn't get many shots on net and, and, you know, kind of converge and try and get those second opportunities. So, yeah. You put a goal in a win, but how are you feeling right now? Feeling what that long stretch without a goal and how you have short on the net? Yeah, no, um, feeling good. Um, obviously a tough loss, um, but we'll move on and, and get ready for next game. I thought it was. Uh, I know a few other guys kind of thought it was too. Um, I don't know if you can challenge that or not. I don't know the ruling on that, but um, you know, I know a few of us thought it was that we're on the ice and right there, but nothing you can do. What was your sense of frustration with that last call on net? Obviously, Sheldon, you don't see that often. Uh, coach, talk. Yeah, I mean, um, I think the whole whole arena saw it on the jumbotron after obviously you, you didn't touch him and you kind of just toe picked on him on his own and um, you know it's hard I guess to make that call it's you know, it's a fast game um, you know but it was a uh, it was a tough call. Kellen, how do you feel about the team's performance tonight? Loved our start in fact I thought it was our best start of the season uh, I'd say the first seven eight minutes I <clears throat> Thought it was better than any start we had when we were on the road. We were really going. Guys were flying and puck, puck was moving well. Our pace was outstanding. We had great scoring chances, didn't score. Line changes, shift flank, like everything that you wanted uh, in the start of the game. Um, I thought we were tremendous there. Puck didn't fall for us. And then I thought it, it, it because it was Going so well, I thought we started to overdo it. I thought we got too comfortable in the game. You can't get comfortable against this team. Like They're just too good defensively. Uh, and I thought we got cute with it. I really slowed our game down and allowed them to kind of settle in. And then it's, it's a pretty even game uh, from there until we, uh, you know, we make a mistake and uh, you know, they get the lead. And then now the game, you've you got to kind of open it up and, and chase it a bit. Can you take us through what led to your clearly exit plan? In terms of things that you said to the refs in the past, like, where did, how disappointing was it in that, at that stage in the game to, to take a penalty, whether regardless if it was earned or not, when you're trying to come back? Like yeah, it's tough. You know, it's, it's, you know, we've got momentum on our side, and, and uh, you, you, you want to kind of get going and get building. It's tough. It, you know, it's, it's tough. It was a tough day to earn power plays tonight. And, um, you know, it's, that's a tough. It's a tough spot in the game there. It's, you know, power plays are four to one in the game. That's a factor uh, in the game. It's not on the officials. That's just part of the way the game goes. That's, that's you know, another thing that didn't go our way here tonight. We didn't do enough during power plays. What did Vegas do better as the game progressed? What did Vegas do better as the game progressed? Well, they defend extremely well. I mean, it's one, of the, it's one of, if not the best defensive team in the NHL. It's 60 and a goalie that won the Stanley Cup last year. So uh, yeah, our team, what worked really well for us for out in Vegas is we, we played a real simple, simple offensive game and we just worked and got pucks to the inside got pucks to the net i thought we did that well to start the game like i said i thought we got a little too comfortable with it and then and then we started to get slow and you get slow they're in now they get in lanes they block shots they get sticks on pucks it's way harder to get to the net uh that way it plays into exactly what they want um and then you know once we we got to our game a little bit in later in the second period but we now by this point we made some mistakes to end up in our net. How do you feel the guys on the, on the blue line did with all the, the six lefties sort of shifting around? In our uh, you know, I th obviously, I, th I thought, thought it was a challenge for us, you know, and, and not so much the lefty part of it, but just the pairs 
um, in general are a bit of a challenge. I mean, we've been going with four lefties, uh, five lefties, excuse me, but but uh, two pairs with, with all lefties, and tonight you're three. But, you know, to me, I thought probably the biggest challenge was on faceoffs, that is where I, I really felt it the most. When you got two lefties out there, you become a lot more predictable on your exits, and and um, and penalty kill, same thing, clearing pucks and such were, were a challenge, but like I said, we've been playing with with uh, two pairs uh, like that and, 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 you know, and uh, getting through it just fine. I don't think that's the story here tonight. John missed that game with the, uh, the injury. Is your, what's your sense of where he's at physically? Like, he's had a bit of discomfort at times tonight? No, I, I, don't, I don't sense that. I think he's, he's fine. Ilya was pretty hard on himself. Ilya, you felt like he could have been better. It was, how do you see his game? I think everybody could be better here tonight, but they had some pretty high-end chances, you know. You, in a game as tight as this, you're going to need some saves, and I thought he gave them to us, but we just, you know, we gave up too much quality, too many quality chances. In fact, going through it, the actual number of chances, we gave up more when we were in Vegas than we gave up here tonight at five on five, but the, some of the quality, obviously, that we gave up tonight is too much.